the earthquake that occurred at Mount Waskaran, 6,768 meters n. m, on May 31, 1970, was one of the deadliest natural disasters in modern times. The earthquake measured 7.9 on the Richter scale and was centered in the Andes Mountains in Peru. It caused a massive landslide that buried the town of Yungay and several other villages in the area, killing an estimated 20,000 people. The avalanche was triggered by an earthquake on Sunday, May 31, 1970, at 3.23 p.m. The tremor loosened a slab of rock about 2,600 feet wide from the west side of the north summit of Waskaran, at an elevation of about 18,400 to 20,300 feet. The fall occurred almost immediately after the tremor began. The rock fell about 2,000 feet and landed on a glacier. It slid nearly 1.9 miles across its surface, accumulating large amounts of snow and ice. The initial volume of the avalanche was at least 33 million at 3 and increased rapidly as it fell down the steep Langanyuko Valley. It continued to pick up large volumes of dirt, loose glacial moraine, water and uprooted trees, and mud and soil below. The front of the avalanche reached speeds of up to 435 km per hour. The avalanche, which was more than a mile wide and several hundred feet thick, swept away everything in its path, including buildings, trees, and people. The mud flow hit Yungay, which is 8.1 miles from the initial avalanche site, less than two minutes after the earthquake began, according to estimates. This was despite the fact that several significant terrain irregularities stood in the way of the avalanche flow. There was almost no time to escape. The avalanche, a stream of snow, ice, rocks, trees and mud, moreover, destroyed the villages of Shilkop, Era and Uo along the way before it descended down to Yungay. The town of Yungay, which was located in the valley below Mount Waskaran, was completely destroyed by the landslide. Most of its 20,000 residents were killed instantly, and only a handful of survivors were found in the rubble. In addition to the human toll, the disaster also destroyed thousands of acres of farmland and caused widespread damage to infrastructure, including roads, bridges, and power lines. The earthquake and landslide at Mount Waskaran were a stark reminder of the power of nature and the importance of disaster preparedness. The disaster prompted new efforts to improve earthquake monitoring and warning systems in Peru and other countries prone to seismic activity. It also led to the development of new techniques for identifying and mitigating the risk of landslides in mountainous regions.